The legend of the White Witch story is one that has survived more than 80 years, possibly even 100. It is said that a woman and the love of her life were returning from an event that was being held in Sonol, California. It is unclear if this event was a prom or a wedding. However, when the event had ended and the two lovers left by way of Niles Canyon, a winding old road that snakes between Fremont and Sonol, there was an accident in which her lover was killed instantly and she perished while trying to find help. On dark, stormy nights, the lady in white flags down the motorist. Some claim they have even picked her up and she has asked them to take her to San Francisco. But before they reach the bridge that takes them across the bay, she has mysteriously disappeared. The legend is so compelling that local psychics have attempted to reach her. One claimed, Oh, she's so sad, she's afraid, and she's lost. An investigative reporter went out to the canyon one night with a thermal camera and walked along the secret sidewalk. This is honestly the strangest thing I've ever seen. As she heard what sounded like footsteps walking nearby, she turned the camera toward the sound she was hearing to scan the area and she could see a human figure walking parallel to her on the other side of the foliage. Hearing this particular story raised a hair on the back of my neck as I recalled the night in the 80s when some friends and I went out to the secret sidewalk ourselves. We too heard the footsteps, but when we stopped to listen, the footsteps would stop also. We even used our flashlights to scan the area and we could see nothing. But once we started walking, so would the footsteps. At one point, we threw an old tin can toward the noise we were hearing. A few seconds later, the same tin was thrown back at us. This was the point in which we all ran. Yes, there are many stories that come out from Niles Canyon. However, they always go back to Marianne, who some also call the White Witch.